all right guys we got a video for you today we got some new reels that just showed up we got ourselves a 288 here about a kilometer cable we got a 144 400 meters we got ourselves a 96 another 160 meter coil and then we got another 360 meter coil of this uh 48 fiber cable uh, these are all loose tube cables and today i'm gonna make a video on how you test your reels to make sure that they're the proper meterages as ordered. All right, let's get into it. So for this job, you're gonna need a cleaver. You're gonna need your AFL Fast Connect. You can have a Ruby on site. I have my launch box, my OTDR, I also have my splicer, but you're not going to need your splicer. Just your quick connect and your cleaver. So once you have that, you're going to want to come in here, grab a hold of that, get the end going. All right. And you're going to have to strip this open and get one of the fibers to throw the quick connect on. All right. All right. So first thing we're going to do, get the ring cut going. We're going to open this cable up a little bit. ring cut around it bend to the sides circular motion until you hear it crack that metal sheathing make sure it's cracked all around let's go ahead and can be tough throw a glove on there you go you got your cable exposed now as you can see, you got 12 tubes on the outside, 12 on the inside, 288 fibers total. It's a gel filled cable, but what we're gonna do is take one of our tubes here, get your ring cutter out. Do a couple inches, pop her open. It's got some gel on it, so give it a quick cleaning. Just clean up a little alcohol quick, right here. Should use D-gel, but this is a quick test, so we are good to go with this instead. All right, once you have that and the fiber exposed, you can go ahead, find your quick connect right there. Get this side of the package, have it ready. Once you have it ready, you can get your Fiber strippers out. Sorry, grab those quickly here. Right here. Now I'm just going to grab any one of these fibers here. Give it a quick strip. You know what? Alcohol out. Clean it. Get it in there. Go ahead. Grab your cleaver. fiber separate Pulls you a nice cleave out of it go ahead grab your fiber quick connect is and just go ahead place it in the back of the quick connect and secured now once you have that done you can go ahead clean up your work area a little bit go to the tools you don't need around go 
ahead and grab your bulkhead. Cap off there. Plug the bulkhead in. Jam that plugged in. Go grab my launch box the other side. There's our clean top. There you go. Give it a cleaning so you're not damaging your launch box. Plug it in there. Same idea with the other part of your launch box. Clean it up right quick. Get it positioned in the OTDR. Go ahead and start it. Gonna jump into OTDR. Let that load up. All right, and then we're just gonna go ahead and shoot it. See what type of length we get here. All right, guys, so yeah, um, we had an issue with the launch box there. Actually, we weren't able to shoot through the reel here. Um, launch box, we had a bad splice in there. It got crushed when whoever put it away last is what it is that happens. So we just scrapped the launch box. We're going to do it with the patch cord now. We'll just patch this into the OTDR, do a bulkhead onto that, and we'll get our shot. So let's do it here. All right, guys, so we're all tied in here. We can go ahead and hit start. We'll just use the simple patch cord there. And uh, let's see what we get. All right, looks like we got it about a kilometer. It's total distance there. Yeah, exactly a kilometer of cable. So there we go. Now we know we have proof that the actual length that we ordered on this reel is confirmed. And uh, if you really wanted to, you could go through each one to verify all fibers, but it's not really that necessary. Um, so yeah, if you guys like this content or you want to see anything like this, have any questions, go ahead and throw it in the comment section and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.